the game. I run the game. I run the I run the macro my name. I run the game. What up everybody, Charles Macro here today back again, jumping back into Imperion Galactic Survival. Alright guys, we are picking up where we left off and the rain is coming down. It's raining on the let it rain all night. <laughs> Man, I hope everybody's doing well. Shout out to you and yours. As we know, in the last episode, we built our HV, our truck vessel. And now, as we're carrying on with the Robinson Protocol, I'm trying to do the Robinson Protocol step by step. They want us to build a shelter. Now, I really don't know if I want to do a base just yet. Hit me in the comment box. Let me know what you think. And in fact, make sure you hit that like button for me, guys. I really appreciate everybody who showed that support. Hit that like button. Subscribe. If you ain't subscribed, share this so others can check this out. And um, just so you guys know, if you hadn't heard, if you didn't hear another video, I just had a child, just had a son. So that's part of the reason why my videos have been sporadic. I still do some recording and playing. I've been playing a few different games. But, um, and you know, even with Imperion in general, that's why I'm kind of just taking my time. Uh, so the frequency will probably pick up, but I'm just going to take it easy and just enjoy, man. I'm just playing this to enjoy, and I thank you guys for sharing it with me, man. But we have my little boy, he's getting older. You know, he's about three weeks now. And so I'm just getting adjusted to it and really, really getting back on schedule with things where I get some videos done. And, and just keep it going, man. Keep it going for my little man. He's going to be a gamer, too. So anyway, we'll go ahead and get on into this thing. So what I'm going to do, I was using the, uh, the HV and it wasn't turning very well and as you guys know when you're building your hover vessel um i needed some rcs's now you don't need rcs's because i made a very simple basic hv using these ground repulsors normally use these hover engines so dang i got a lot of points i didn't even realize that i haven't been using any points yet so what i'm gonna do is unlock these rcs's because they help with turning um they're a device that helps with the turning of a vessel then you use your thrusters oh thrusters as well that's the other thing i need i need to add some thrusters so thank you to everybody who's hit me in the comments kind of reminding me because it's, it's been a while i'm gonna go ahead and unlock the gatling guns uh the mini guns yeah it's been a while uh again we're getting back into this thing for real for real so okay we have the generator we have the small fuel tank the small generator we'll get this larger size one and i think these even will make your cpu yeah cpu 225 cpu 150 cpu 75 cpu 112 so i have to be aware of these cpus and how much it uses cpu 50 cpu 34 fridge why can't i unlock that oh i haven't unlocked cargo boxes let me unlock cargo boxes now i can unlock the fridge later definitely that fridge later so we can um keep everything that we stock up keep everything that we, we collect food wise fresh okay the container controller uh, we'll go ahead and unlock that container for wood the ammo container and we'll do this container extension I'm also do a mini gun and I put everything on here just yet we'll go ahead and unlock the hover engine too harvester yeah we're getting our unlock on in this one oh yeah need a spotlight definitely that detector yes yes okay so and right now i am gonna wait on the generator you know i got the points i wait on this regular generator regular fuel tank because again that may make my cpu necessity or need go up we got base capital vessel weapons Let's see, if I build a base, I really, really, I think it's under weapons. I really want to unlock my light armor as well, just so I can not be cold. I also can jump, you know, do the little boost jump, jetpack type jump. I can't do that right now until we unlock that. Uh, so let's see, miscellaneous. Got our pistol starter blocks. Oh, your wireless connection. Let's get that. And we'll get to auto miners. Tools. It's going to unlock our multi tool. The ore scanner. Yes. And okay. Probably could get this portable work light. 
yeah, we definitely gonna need this drill when we get to level seven. We'll be there momentarily. Okay, so now that we have a lot more cracker lady. Oh, I wanna unlock that light armor. I'm trying to wait, I'm trying to wait. See, they gonna make me go ahead and start on the base early. Okay, I'm not gonna do the base this episode. I'm not gonna do that. I want y'all to let me know in the comments because I know a lot of you guys are still playing and have been playing more recently. Should I go ahead, build a base because we want drone attacks, right? If I build a base, how long does it take before the real attacks happen or do they not happen until you really are on the bad side of the Xerax? Like, will the longer you play, the more intense the base attacks get or do you have to get the Xerax angry on a faction level? before they start sending the ships and sending the let's go and collect this while we talk sending the ships sending the um the xerox troops at you will it just continue to be just drones because we'll go ahead and build a base and get drones but i'm gonna definitely need some more resources so yeah y'all let me know in the comments and i'm gonna wait next episode and i'll probably get that next episode turned around a little sooner Cause I also need like this, this thing ain't got enough energy. The uh, solar panels aren't powering this well enough. I need to bring a fuel source, put a fuel tank on this if I'm gonna keep using it. Again, I know unless things have changed, if I stay here, the drone attacks won't come. But we want this thing to be real deal holy field. All right, so let me go ahead and craft this RCS. Go ahead and craft the RCS. Uh, do we have enough resources? We may not have the resources for it. Uh, where is it at? There we go. I'm going to just do one. One should be enough for it now. Uh, we'll, do a, we'll do a regular cargo box. I'm going to do with well, my next build when I upgrade this to a real deal holy field hover vessels. I'll use the cargo containers and the cargo controllers. I believe I need to make a better constructor anyway before I can do that. Oh yeah, I need to unlock the armor locker too to put armor on. So yeah, we'll wait. We can't even craft them right now anyway. Where is the advanced constructor? I don't even see it being locked. Let me, let me, okay, small constructor. Yeah, so I would need to unlock and place the small constructor before I could build some better level parts or pieces for the HV. So I'm going to try, okay, here we go. What I'm going to do is try this RCS, see if it makes a difference on my turning. If not, it's thrusters. And I'm going to need to add some thrusters. So let's go on and place the jammy in here. Bam. Let's go on and get inside. Man, I used to never turn my vessels off. I would leave it on all the time. Okay, let's see. Oh, yeah, there it is. Yeah, that's making a big difference. That's making a big difference, that one RCS. Okay. I think thrusters will help, but again, the hover engines, whatever they're called, that I have on here, they already add a, a level of what the thrusters would do when you have them on there. But I think the thrusters would help my turning also. Okay, let's turn this off. I'm gonna do one light, left and right thruster just for good measure. This is a little bit of experimentation. They go to cargo box. A little bit of experimentation, guys. Motor nanotubes. Uh, I don't have enough resources. Let's see, I have iron, copper, silicon. Hmm. Why can't I make that motor and nanotubes? Let's see what we need for a motor. You need nanotubes for a motor for nanotubes. I need carbon substrate. Oh, okay, I need more trees. And I put that in here. You know what? Let me just go chop a few more logs. And let me go chop a few more logs from this tree. Right? Hey, the tree disappeared. What in the world? <laughs> what in the world? The tree disappeared. Did y'all see that? Tree just be disappearing now? That happened before too on my other game. The tree just disappeared. I, I really need to be using my drone mining. 
Uh, okay, that should be enough for now. That tree just totally disappeared. Alright. Let me turn it back to the base. Back to the base. Let's put that in there. Okay, boom. Now we can build us a thruster. I really could do the regular hover engine. I'm going to do two. One on the left side, one on the right side. See if that helps us without turning. Uh, this fridge. CB and base. No, that's not the right fridge. So yeah, I'm going to have to get to this small constructor eventually. I also want to open up some base. Uh, some more things at the base. But I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that. The tools. We got the multi-tool. We'll eventually do the drill. Uh, we still got to get to level 7 for that. Well, okay. We got the pour. We already have this. Even though I should open it. And the ventilator. We're not going to worry about that for oxygen. We got the shoddy. Let's see what's on level 5. Uh, I'll go ahead and unlock the assault rifle. The shoddy is great for close quarters. Again, I do want to do this light armor. Man, I want to do this. But I'm... I'm gonna wait to see even the T2 sniper rifle eh, I'm gonna wait to see if once we do build the base if it prompts us to do so so we're gonna do some light exploring I, I added the RCS I'm gonna add a couple thrusters Let's see one is done we'll wait on this second thruster and I need to, I do need to open something up in this base because I need a source, like a fuel tank for the base. Because this uh, solar system ain't working well enough. Let me go over here and check this capacitor while we thinking about it. It's a little bit buried. I wonder if that makes a difference. Uh, let's see, can I dig with this? Defense mode, salvage, resource drill. There we go. It's gonna be a little dip. It's a little funky. But we gotta clear this out some. I'm gonna need to put some base blocks under this. O2 tank. Now, does that make a difference? Cause it's like it's not holding enough charge. Maybe because I put this refrigerator in here, it's taking too much. Uh, how do you see how much energy is consuming okay power 62 pu none yeah it's only doing one percent statistics uh blah 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 current output 36 okay average output 33 is that how much it needs it need it should only be able to hold 33 and it's outputting 38 so that's too much is that how we tell somebody let me know that in the comments as well does that mean I just need like a second solar panel? I need to take one of these blocks and put them. So I made her. Uh, I think that was the reason why I really wanted to do a little bit of exploring. Even though staying right here would be nice. It's because uh, we need to know where some of our resources are. We know the unknown structure is over here. And we have a pentaxid ore over there, which is great. But really seeing where we want to set up the base. You know what, though, since I am, again, back relearning things. And what do we have on this? What is that? Gold. Okay, we have some gold here. But Prometheum. There'll be a little bit of cobalt in the radiated area. Since we're back learning things, I'll probably keep my base over here. I started over here. We got mountains right there. Yeah, i stay in this zone until we really relearn. And then when we start a second uh, series... We start a second start. We'll go and find a base and put it somewhere else. All right, so let's see if this stuff is crafted. All right, we're good. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Okay. Eight. Ah, uh, since I don't have a multi tool, it only destroys the blocks. Well, it is what it is. Alright, we'll put our first block right there. Let's rotate it around. Uh oh. Uh. There we go. We'll put one right there. And it's right at the rear of the cockpit. So. Let's get rid of this block. 
rotate once again. Bam. Now let's see if that helps without turning left and right. Ooh. Well, it definitely helps with <laughs> driving left and right. The RCS helped with it a little more, so that's cool. Man, I remember when the speeds couldn't get this high. Like, this was the speed of the, the SV, basically. All right, cool. Cool, cool. We're good. I can't build the... Can I even build any weapons in this yet? Let's see. Let's see. We don't know for sure. Let's park. I don't know if I can build weapons either. Uh, weapons for the ship. No, I'm going to need that small constructor to build Gatlings for the ship. All right. So now that I talk it out, I think I am going to end up doing this base here. But again, let me know in the comments. Let me know in the comments. And uh, we'll go from there. Cool, 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 cool. Alright, so let's do a little bit of exploring. This um, Xerax territory is up here. But we'll set a point for that way, waypoint. Remove upon approach, except. Let's see what we find. Let me raise up a little bit. Let's get our travel on. See if we can find some new resources. Sure to be a spider or two up through here. Yeah, the feel is definitely different. Like even driving. It definitely feels different from, from back in the day. Uh-oh, now this is water. I do know I cannot pass over water, so. Okay, we need to be going this way. Now that is a, a large body of water. blocks around core okay at least like they explain the building process a little better uh-oh 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 it is cool i can kind of draw oh, the tallura pies the tallura pies i hate them things i do not like them things i do not like them things we're going to destroy them from afar. They just look like, ugh. You look like, ugh. Don't be trying to come over here and mess with me. You lucky I ain't got no Gatlins. You lucky I ain't got no Gatlins. They lucky I ain't got no Gatlins. Where am I going? Uh, let's look at our map. Oh, look, we done started going the wrong way. We done got distracted. Now the tilt and the up and down, you can't control this pretty well. Okay. Yo, we flying. We flying. Let me zoom out just a little bit. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Oh, spiders. Yo, this hover joint can move. I am not used to it just moving this fast. Like, for real, the speed differential is... Yeah, I hear you, spider. We, we trying to explore right now, man. Get off us, son. Okay, we found a small iron deposit. Okay. Oh, the little uh, bird dinosaur -y things. 
What's up, that bird dinosaurs? Okay, we in the little tundra area. Nice, nice, nice. All right, all right, all right. Trying to see if we see any uh, other factions as well. Any other faction territory. Are we close to the poles? Okay, that's the poles right there. Oh, snap. Oh, I'm stuck. Oh, I'm stuck. Oh, are they serious? Come on, man. Let me get off of this. Oh, I am stuck. Wow, guys. I have gotten stuck. Am I going to be able to get off of this? Forward, back, up, down, left, right, left, right, B, A, select, start. Come on, man. I am stuck between a rock and a hard place. Like, literally. Oh, they are... They is tripping. Okay. Let me, uh, uh, let me get out. Let me get out. So, I got the chainsaw so maybe I can chop this thing up see I don't even know if it's actually chopping it or not oh, come on that is trash that is trash okay we're gonna try to Take out this rock, man. Drill. Let's see. There we go. Look at that. It worked itself out. <laughs> it worked itself out. We're going to go back this way. We're going to go west. Oh, you know what? I need to monitor my fuel consumption. Oh, okay. 700 minutes so i'm good i'm good we real good on the fuel this thing oh man i have to watch this thing it gets now what's up with the tree stuckish i've never gotten stuck on trees like this before this has never been a thing yeah this has never been a thing this is new to me getting stuck on trees oh, wow my chainsaw is out of hand Oh, man. Yeah, this is new to me getting stuck on trees. Come on, man. Is this thing going to disappear? There we go. So I guess I got to watch out for the trees, like, for real. For real, for real. Yeah, I hear you, man. I hear you. Okay, my portable constructor is that way. Up, 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 Polaris. I see some Polaris territory coming up. Okay, iron deposit. Now, will we receive any backlash for heading into the Polaris territory? We should be peace. Everything should be peace. Let's see, what's the uh, faction joint? How do you get the factions? Oh, right here. Okay, we're neutral with the Polaris. We're neutral with the Talon. But we're almost friendly with the Polaris. Let me make sure uh, what neutral. Uh, Stay outside of Polaris territory. Be hostile. Friendly or better. Okay. Well, it shouldn't be a big deal with entering that territory. Only if we do anything. We we can't mind. We can't do anything. Or it could cause some problems. Oh. Wow. Look at that city. So they do have some defensive. Wow. Look at this. 
Look at this. Let's make sure we don't get shot at. Like, I'm not sure what happens, but we shouldn't be getting shot at. We should be able to enter their territory and it be all love. Wow, we just glancing, we just glancing. We just glancing. Now the Polaris, they are a um think they have, you know, economy. They're a they're like an industrial people. Very industrious. Let's check this out right here. Wow. It's a dope design. The Polaris Oppressor. Wow. Look at that. Look at that. Let's look at that. With wow, man, people get crazy with their designs. Like that is dope. That is dope. Come on, spiders! Don't y'all see me trying to, you know, you know, explore this region and kind of get to know these people? See what's going on around y'all. Let's drive up here. Let's drive up here. What y'all talking about? Okay. Yeah, that's pretty dope. And they be mining and stuff. Let's see if we can fly off of here. This is pretty cool. This is pretty cool. All right. Yeah, I think if you kill spiders in their territory and stuff like that, that actually... It gains you favor. Cool, cool. Oh, spiders! Now, I didn't hear them spiders, man. Come on, y'all gotta let me know what's what's crackling. Okay. The spiders were trying to creep. All right, cool, 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 guys. So. What I do, I figure we will. Is that water? Oh, no, 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 no. Ooh. Yo, this whole tree thing is a trip. I'm going to have to. Ooh, hot dogs. <laughs> to let my mind just switch that quick. Ooh, hot dogs. I really got to make an effort to watch out for those trees. That can be a problem. Let's see. Is this water or is this all landmass? Make sure I can cross. Okay. All right, cool. Oh, the tundra got to load in. All right, cool, guys. So, oh, we coming back around. Okay, so we see in the talent. I see talent area. But I am not going to go there. What I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up. And in the next one, as we continue exploring around, we'll go into this talent area and see what their uh, region looks like. See how they want to act. All right. So, guys, hit me in the comment box. Make sure you like. Make sure you subscribe. Let me know about the base. Let me know if I should continue on and um, go ahead and do that base right there in the home area, which I'm thinking I'll do since this is, again, a new restart. We're relearning things. We'll go ahead and just start the base uh, right there at the at the little uh, drop zone area, the crash site. In the future, we'll find uh, another area, or maybe do a more difficult start, or, go, or start on a planet with no oxygen or something. Or again, even if we do it on this planet, we'll go to a more difficult area. I may just get away from the Xerax a bit. Let's see, there's a no build zone. Xerox talent, yes. But in the next one, we'll go ahead and we'll slide through this talent area and see what's up with them. Alright. Alright, guys. So again, thank you for stopping through. Make sure you hit that like button for me. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. Share this so others can check this out. And you know, you know I'm glad y'all rocking with me, man. And check out some of my other series that I got going on, man. We got a lot we trying to do. Charles Macro, Imperion Galactic Survival. Thank you for stopping through. And I'ma holla at you. Peace. I run the game. I run the game. I run the I run the macro my name. I run the game.